Hello everybody, it's Tim Spector here of the Zoe Symptom Study app, giving an update on vaccines this time. And as you know, the UK has been very successful in its vaccination program. Over 10% of the population have now been vaccinated and doing about half a million people a day, which is a fantastic progress. And most people are having uh, a single vaccination shot and waiting 12 weeks for the next one. So our data and the data you're collecting, and we already now have 200,000 data points from you guys, is helping uh, us tell the government uh, how well this um, plan is, is going. And firstly, the good news is that we are seeing after 12 days a 50 3% reduction in uh, new cases of COVID compared to uh, a, a control group who aren't being vaccinated. And this data is based on healthcare workers who do have a higher risk of infection. But we think the same is going to be tr true in the other populations. So that's uh, the first data that in real life outside trials, this uh, these vaccinations are working after the first shot. But remember, this is only a partial protection. Uh, we hope that 53% will get better. We don't know yet. The other point is the first 12 days, there is absolutely no protection whatsoever. The immune system doesn't kick in. You are not getting any assistance from this virus. And it's a particularly vulnerable time because most people having had their jab are feeling much more confident and maybe taking more risks. So do be careful with that. In terms of the side effects, um, again, very reassuring so far. We're seeing uh, less than one in five people with any real problems. Four out of five, that's eight. Eighty percent of people are, are fine. Um, most people just have a slight sore arm afterwards. Of the people that do have problems, um, Generally, headache and fatigue are the main ones, slight feverishness another. And we're seeing that certain groups are more likely to get uh, side effects than others. And we told you uh, last, year, last week that females are more likely and that's still holding up. So females have uh, an increased risk compared to males. And if you're under 55, the younger groups are seeing more side effects than the over 55s. And that's maybe just because there's a, a greater immune response. The uh, other side effects uh, are reported about double, uh, up to about a third of people who've had previous COVID. And again, perhaps relating to the fact they, they are generating more antibodies. So that should be generally reassuring. We're not seeing any rare or very dangerous side effects. And if you do, then they should be reported in the normal way anyway. And we're working with the MHRA with your data. So nothing worrying has been found so far. Uh, and that's good news. It does seem to be working 50% uh, protection uh, after that 12 day period, which should start be uh, helping the infection rates and maybe one reason why the rates of hospital admissions have started to uh, come down across the country as well as the new cases. Uh, finally, uh, we've updated the app uh, to allow you to go on and log your vaccine, which one it was, whether it was the AstraZeneca, the Pfizer or one of the new ones that are coming on in the next few weeks. And you can do that uh, retrospectively to really improve the records. So um, we're trying to get this data as good as we can and work with you on that. Uh, we also uh, do want people in the vaccine centres, in GPs, to spread the word to people to uh, get uh, people using the app and therefore recording their, their symptoms and whether they get reinfected or not. This is really vital information and uh, you can go on our, our website and find out more about how you can help with that. We have a webinar uh, on Wednesday at 4pm and we already have 
an amazing 50,000 people have signed up, but uh, we can accommodate more. Uh, so if you are interested, uh, just follow the link. This is all good news about vaccination uh, and with rates coming down, I think uh, we are looking in a much better place in February than we were in January. So stay safe and keep logging. Thank you.